Hi everyone, today I'm showing you how to achieve this super easy, messy faux bob. I actually have medium length hair, I'd like to say. It's quite short on the sides, but a bit long at the back. I'm first going to part my hair. I'm going to have a side part today. I usually do have a middle part, but I was actually copying a Miley Cyrus kind of look today. So I'm going to hairspray that down so it kind of sticks. And I'm using this barrel from Irresistible Me, the sapphire wand that tapers out so it's a little bit strange. First going in with some heat protectant on my hair. Then dividing it up into two sections and I'm going to curl the bottom section first. I do like to wear my glove because I would burn myself if I didn't. So yeah. I am curling the hair away from my face, so just keep that in mind. Um, I guess it doesn't matter because it's all a really messy hairstyle anyway, so you could curl whichever way you want. Then I'm going to take the top section and curl that as well. I'm not going to brush out the ringlets, I'm going to let them sit there for a little bit and you'll see when I let them drop, they fall into my hand and then they just sit there and then I'll brush them out at the end. You don't have to be super precise or neat or anything like that. I just did a really quick once over and then I'll go and touch up some curls that need some more. Then I'm going to brush it out with my fingers, just comb my fingers through my hair and give it some hairspray. Now I do want to let you know my hair is actually a few days old here from being washed so it does make it a lot easier to style. What I'm doing here is taking sections of hair, spraying some hairspray and then back combing it or teasing it because I want heaps of volume. And teasing it does actually assist in the process of making my hair shorter which is what I want. So I'm just fast forwarding through this because I just want you to see like every section I take which is pretty much my whole head. This is the first time using that brush thingy and I it didn't really work that well for me. I would probably actually prefer a fine tooth comb which is what I usually do use. So when that's all done I'm going to take the longer sections of my hair and I know no one would have the exact same hair as me but I'm just going to take these longer ones and curl them under and pin them to my head. I am going to use a couple of bobby pins to secure it but I'm just taking these two main longer bits on the side and putting a couple of bobby pins in and yeah it gives it a bit of volume as well being looped under. And then I'll see what I have left over and I've just got this last bit here so I will just tuck it underneath there with some bobby pins and it's really as easy as that. So now time for the finishing touches. I'm just going to play around with it, fluff it around, tease it a little bit more, curl it a little bit more, a little more, more hairspray, everything like that. Then I want to curl some back sections because it wasn't looking how I wanted it to look. And it still didn't look that good at the back. It looked nice on the front and the sides, but the back wasn't amazing. But I wasn't going anywhere, so I didn't need the back to look that great. But you could spend a little bit extra time and it will look a fab. Anyway, that is the end of my hair tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was super easy. So have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye. In other news, I don't think I'm about to do. This is how my makeup and hair turned out for the Miley Cyrus look. Um, I can't, I don't. I'm not exactly like stoked with how the bulb turned out, um, but whatevs.